hi guys in today's video i want to show you, to give you some of the signs that your your buds are getting sick or that your buds are sick if you are a poultry farmer or you're planning to be one you need to know these things because yeah uh, when we had our buds the very first time the buds fell sick which really took us time to identify them but yeah after after some time we were able to identify them but some of them could not recover so here are some of the signs that you will notice when the buds are not feeling okay you are welcome to my youtube channel my name is asperia if you are watching me for the very first time and i am a very passionate poultry farmer i also love farming so you are in the right place and so subscribe join us and let's get started but one the very first sign that you will see when your buds are getting sick loss of appetite now if you are dealing in layers these buds love food they love eating and the moment you bring food they will move up and down and finish the food now when you come into the poultry house to check on them and you find the feeders are still filled with food the food is not moving that is a sign that your buds are not okay. You need to check them. You need to see whether they are stressed, whether they are sick, whether they have flu, whether they have cough, whether they have any other form of illness. The moment you see your buds are not consuming food at the rate which you expect them to, that is a really a bad sign. It shows that your buds are sick. And number two, isolation. When there are so many corners in the poultry house, when a bird food sick they always do not want to stay where the other birds are because they feel sick they feel weak they feel cold sometimes so they always isolate themselves and keep themselves into the corners of the house the moment you find birds isolated like hiding just know that these birds are not okay so every time you enter a poultry house first look in the corners first look around behind the laying boxes in the corners the moment you find there are some birds just check them you will find that one or two of those birds is sick so be very careful when you see the birds isolating themselves when the birds are getting sick you see them having general body weakness like they're all they are not so healthy they are not active they're not running up and down and jumping some of them are just like this these birds when they are healthy the layers they love jumping they love you know they be like all over the place when you enter the poultry house they welcome you when you have food they run after you now when these birds are getting sick when there is a sickness they're not active they are just I think they also feel body weakness. Number three, you will see diarrhea in the house. Now, diarrhea is one of the signs of most of the diseases of poultry. Uh, if it is a costidiosis, it starts with diarrhea. And because all of these diseases, they present with diarrhea. So when you see diarrhea in the poultry house, you see those loose stools everywhere in the house, waterly stools on the feeders, on the drinkers. Don't take that for granted. There is a sickness in inside the poultry house that you need to check and then get these birds treated and then another thing you need to see now the very first bird of ours that died of diseases it got that this called infectious coriza and it presented with flu like symptoms and the birds had a lot of flu coming like fluids coming out of their noses and yeah it was really not okay and so these birds reached an extent of fading to breathe guys i have a video that i took when the birds were really struggling to breathe and so the moment you see your birds are having flu nose nozzle discharges things are coming out of their nose don't take that for granted it's not a mistake they are not just you know bringing water that they drank it is a sign of sickness it could be flu it could be cough it could be maybe infectious coriza infectious bronchitis you need to see that you get these birds treated first isolate those birds that you see that are not healthy and then get them treated 
And then another thing that you need to see, you see ruffled feathers. The moment you see the bird is just confused, like the feathers are, mm -hmm. they are like, mm, to whom it may concern, it is just not okay to put the feathers in order. The moment the birds are healthy, you always see them moving up and down, you see them jumping, you hear the sounds, but when you enter a poultry house where the birds are sick, you feel no joy. The feathers are looking up and down, like it is all looking miserable. When you look at your bird and it's not organized, just know that there is a disease in the poultry house. Most of these si these poultry diseases are silent. They do not like they are, they don't really come out very visible. That's why you have to be very vigilant and observant. When you see something wrong in the poultry house, please you need to take urgent action. So many other factors that so many other signs that you can look at and you'll be able to tell that your birds are sick when they're not drinking water, when they are they have they are depressed they look so sad they're not active they're not eating a lot of things to add into this video but a few things that i've shared are practically true i have seen them in my farm and if you observe and treat your birds very early then you can be able to save the flock then lastly you can also see wounds on the head on the chickens whenever you see wounds don't take that for granted sometimes okay some birds speak each other but if you have depicted them there is no need of there there is no way where you can find wounds on the bird so whenever you see wounds maybe it is fall fox is coming you know? so be always careful the moment you see feces that have blood inside a poultry house don't take that for granted then a bloody discharge that you see in the litter in the poultry house on the sticks the, the trees that you have put here for them to stand on the moment you see see blood drops there don't take that for granted it's a sickness and it needs your attention so when you are when you attend to your birds and you treat them most of poultry diseases are treatable especially if you have vaccinated your birds so i believe you found something very helpful in this video that is so click subscribe like the video share it with your friends and i love you